Hi guys, my name is Steven and welcome back to me reading Luke and today I'll be reading Luke chapter 3. Now in the 15th year of the reign of Tiberius, Syria, Caesar appointed Pilate being governor of Judea, Herod being Tetrarch, Galilee, his brother Philip, Tetrarch of Ethuria and the region of Trichartus and Lysanias, Tetrarch of Abilene, while Annas and Caiaphas were high priests. The word of the, the word of God came to John, the son of Zacharias, in the wilderness, and he went into all the region around Jordan, preaching a baptism of repentance for the remission of sin. As it is written in the book of the words of Isaiah the prophet, saying, "The voice of one crying in the wilderness, prepare the way of the Lord, make his path straight. Every valley shall be filled, and every mountain and hill brought low. The crooked place shall be made straight, and the Rough waves smooth, and all flesh shall see the salvation of God. Then he said to the multitudes that came out of the baptized by him, brawled of vipers, who warned you to flee from the wrath to come. Therefore bear fruit worthy of repentance, and do not begin to say to yourself, We have Abraham as our father. For I say to, that, to you that God is able to raise up children to Abraham from these stones, and even now the axe is laid to the root of the trees. Therefore every tree which does not bear good fruit, is cut down and thrown into the fire. So the people asked him, saying, What shall we do then? He answered and said to them, He who has two tunics, let him give to him who has none, and he who has food, let him do likewise. The tax collector also came to baptize and said to him, Teacher, what shall we do? And he said to them, Collect no more than what is appointed for you. Likewise, the shoulder asked him, saying, What shall I do? He said to them, Do not intimidate anyone or accuse falsely and be content with your wages now as the people were in expectation no reason in their heart about john whether he was the christ or not john answered saying to them saying to all i indeed baptize you with water but one mighty mightier than i is coming whose sandal straps i am now worthy to loose he will baptize you with the holy spirit spirit and fire his winnowing fan is in his hand and he will thoroughly clean out his threshing floor and gather the wheat into his barn. For the chaff he will burn with un unquenchable fire. And when many other exhortions he preached to the people, but Herod the Tetrarch being rebuked by him concerning Her Herodias his brother Philip's wife and for all the evil which Herod had done, also added this above all that he shut John up in prison. When all the people were baptized, it came to pass that Jesus also was baptized, and while he was he was praying, the heaven was opened, and the Holy Spirit descended in bodily form like a dove upon him, and a voice came from heaven which said, You are my beloved Son, you who am I well pleased. Now Jesus himself began his ministry at about thirty years of age, being, as was supposed, the son of Joseph, the son of Heli, the son of Matthew, the son of Levi, the son of Melchi, the son of Janet, the son of Joseph, the son of Matthaniah, the son of Amos, the son of Nahum, the son of Esli, the son of Nagai, the son of Math, the son of Matthew, the son of Semai, the son of Joseph, the son of Judah, the son of Jonas, the son of Ressa, the son of Zerubbabel, the son of Shealtiel, the son of Zeri, the son of Melchi, the son of Adai, the son of Kosam, the son of El Modim, the son of Ur, the son of Jos. The son of Eliezer, the son of Joram, the son of Matthew, the son of Levi, the son of Simon, the son of Judah, the son of Joseph, the son of Jonah, the son of Elikam, the son of Meli, the son of Menon, the son of Matthew, the son of Nathan, and the son of David, the son of Jesse, the son of Obed, the son of Boaz, the son of Salmon, the son of Nashan, the son of Aminadab, the son of Ram, the son of Hezron, the the son of Perez, the son of Judah, the son of Jacob, the son of Isaac, the son of Abraham, the son of Terah, the son of Nahor, the son of Sarah, the son of Reu, the son of Plague, the son of Eber, the son of Shelah, the son of Cana, the son of Arphaxad, the son of Shem, the son of Noah, the son of Lamech, the son of Meshuselah, the son of Enoch, the son of Jared, the son of Malalel, the son of Canaan, the son of Enosh, the son of Seth, the son of Adam, the son of God. Luke chapter 3.